This is David Hofmeister's Unwind Your Mind Back to God, read by Tarana Singh. In today's episode, we continue unlearning the world with Book 2. In Chapter 4, this is Section 5, Beyond the Belief in Victimization. If there is such a thing as a victim, there is no God. Yet since God is real and all-loving, all-knowing and all-powerful, victimization is impossible. What could victimization be but an illusion, a misperception? Questions about the evil or the horrors of the world are pseudo-questions, for they but ask and answer from the assumption that error is real. The first question that ever seemed to be asked was asked by the ego. Who am I? And every question throughout history is but an illusory doubt about the certainty of the I am presence. God is without question. Christ is without question. Follow the trail of the question to the so-called questioner. Seeing the impossibility of the questioner is true freedom. For identity in God is beyond question. Search and question you will while illusions seem to persist. Question what you believe what you assume to be true. Question your perceptions and your desire for things in the world. Question the faith which has been placed in the ego. Then ask yourself if there is anything worth hanging on to that perpetuates guilt and fear and hatred. The ego made this world. Instead of questioning the seeming effects of error, the persons, events and circumstances of the world it is good to question the underlying error that separation is possible at all. Why question effects when their cause is unreal and has no foundation? God did not create the ego so it has no source. God created his child as spirit and so identity is spirit. No dream of fear can veil the truth of our eternal being. I love you for such is self-love. It cannot be difficult to accept the truth. Illusions are difficult to maintain for they have nothing to stand on. 
Let us watch them disappear like sand castles in the vast tide of the ocean.